For unto us a child is born, to us a son is given, and the government will be on his shoulders, and he will be called Wonderful, Counselor, Mighty God, Everlasting Father, Prince of Peace. Of the greatness of his government and peace, there will be no end. Oh God. sent from God unto a city of Galilee named Nazareth, to a virgin espoused to a man whose name was Joseph, and the virgin's name was Mary. And the angel said unto her, Hell, thou that are highly favored, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. And when she saw him, she was troubled at his saying, and cast in her mind what manner of salutation this should be. And the angel said unto her, Fear not, Mary, for thou hast found favor with God. Now shalt conceive in thy womb, and bring forth a son, and shall call his name Jesus. And he shall be great, and shall be called the Son of the Highest.
a decree went out from Caesar Augustus that all the world should be taxed in their own city. So Mary and Joseph traveled to Bethlehem, and while they were there, her days were accomplished that she should be delivered. Mary brought forth her firstborn son, and wrapped him in swaddling clothes, and laid him in a manger, because there was no room for them in the inn.
They were in the same country, shepherds abiding in the field, keeping watch over their flock by night. And lo, the angel of the Lord came upon them, and the glory of the Lord shone round about them, and they were afraid. The angel said to them, Fear not, for behold, I bring you good tidings of great joy, which shall be to all people. For unto you is born this day in the city of David a Savior, which is Christ the Lord. This will be a sign unto you. You shall find the babe wrapped in swaddling clothes, lying in a manger. And suddenly there was with the angels a multitude of heavenly hosts. Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace, goodwill toward men. Born in Bethlehem, behold, there was wise men from the east, 
saying, Where is he born of the Jews? We have seen his star in the east and are come to worship him. The star they had seen went before them till it stood over where the child was born. They saw the child and his mother and presented their gifts of gold, frankincense, and myrrh. They bowed down and worshipped him.
praise God. You know, I've been thinking about being outside at night in the weather. <laughs> We've all been praying and praying and praying, Lord, don't let it be too hot. Don't let it be too cold. Don't let it, let it just be just right. You know, we're like bears. Baby bear, just right. And it's, I was looking up as, as they were doing their parts and, and coming out at their appointed times. And I was thinking, this is probably not the way that it was the night that Jesus was born. It was probably cold. You know, they had some, they had some uh, weather back then and, and then, and it's like, you know, in a stable, there was no room. You've heard it over and over and over in, at, the, at Christmas time. There was no room in the inn. I thought about that today, and I thought about it the other day. No room in the inn. And so they went to a stable. Now, we got a nice little stable right here. Or, or thanks to the, uh, the buyer construction. We, we appreciate what they've done. And it's, it's a really good stable. But you know, in my mind, I don't think that that's what this stable looks like that Jesus was born in. That Jesus, the, the, a, a, real, a real baby, a, a real being, was put in a feeding trough. Think about it. Would you put your child in a feeding trough? Our Savior, the Savior of the world, He came and they laid Him in a manger. And it was actually a feeding trough. And what did He come for? He came for us. He came to save us, to, to forgive us of our sins, to die on the cross for us so that we might live forever. Amen. Amen. I don't know about y'all, but during this time of season, I just think about that babe in the manger. And I think he was, before he came here, he was sitting beside the Father in heaven. And he said, Father, I'll go. I'll give it all up. And I'll go, and I will die for these people, because they're our people, and I love them. There's a kind of love, that's a kind of love that we'll never be able to explain here on this earth, ever, never. But he did it. I want y'all to look up at the moon for just a minute. Everybody just focus on that, this this evening and know that as bright as that light is Jesus is even brighter Jesus as bright as these lights right here Jesus is even brighter and I'm going to tell you tonight if you don't know the Lord as your Savior there's no better time Christmas time is a, is a really good time come to the Lord if you don't know Him and I know that some of you are really are, are a little cold and, and we've got refreshments, we've got coffee and we've got hot chocolate and we've got waters and all kind of cookies in, in the sanctuary waiting on you. But I'm going to tell you, I'm going to be standing out here if there's anybody tonight, anybody that needs to pray, anybody that, need, that has a need if you just have a need, if you're a saved person and, and you've been saved all your life, but you got a need and you need somebody to pray with you, I'm going to be standing here waiting on you as, as, as we close out tonight and as you prepare to go inside and, and warm up a little bit and get you a little snack. Just remember, this time, there was no room in the inn. But then the light, the light shined out of darkness and brought marvelous, marvelous light into this world. And it's all about him anyway, y'all. 
It's not about anything that we could do, anything we could say. It's all about Jesus and what He done for us and that He loves us so much. Our Father sent His Son into the world not to condemn the world. John uh, 3.17 says not to condemn the world, but that the world through Him might be saved. That's what it's all about. Make sure that in this season that you know the Lord as your personal Savior. Make sure that's the most important thing that I would say to you tonight. Is just make sure that your heart's right with God. And that you're living for Him. Because I'll be honest with you, there's nothing like it. There's nothing I, I can't even give you words in my, in, in my vocabulary that would tell you how I feel in my heart because I have the Lord Jesus Christ. It, it's better, as the old, old people used to say, it's better felt than tailed. Amen? Let's pray. Father, we love you. We thank you and we praise you for all that you have done. There's so much, Lord, to just thank you for. Oh, you're so good to us, and you watch over us, and you give us good things, Lord. And as, as we go on in the next couple of days, Lord, when the season comes and seasons go, we're still going to remember you because we know, Lord, that you are our Savior our great and wonderful Savior, mighty God, Prince of Peace, everlasting Father, and there is none like you. None in all the heavens and in all the earth, Lord, there is none like you. And we're thankful for that. Lord, help us. Help us not to forget, Lord, during this time when, when we're so busy and so caught up with things, Lord. Help us not to forget, Lord, to thank you for what you've done for us. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Lord, I pray that you bless these people, God. Bless the, the snacks that we're about to have, Lord Jesus. Bless the hands that prepared them, Father God. And we'll give you all the glory, all the honor, and all the praise. For it's in your name we pray these things. Amen. And amen. We appreciate y'all coming out. I know it's a little cold, and, and but we want you to go inside and get some snacks. And we also want to say thanks to my sister Brenda Dietrich. She's the one that writes our plays and directs them. And yes, y'all give her a hand clap this tonight. And then all of this, all of the uh, play. Oh, what do you call y'all? Drama team. Drama team, the drama team. I'll get it out in a minute. Y'all give them a hand clap too tonight. They done a really good job, didn't they? And they look so good, especially Charlie with that baby. <laughs> He's showing it to everybody. <laughs> Praise God. Y'all have a good night. Please come in and have some snacks. You're dismissed. Okay. Val. Love incarnate, love divine. Star and angels beat the sign. Bow to the one bending knee. The Savior of humanity.
next song.